Happy times in Toronto this evening as the Maple Leafs win a tight one against the Buffalo Sabres. But what happened? You went over to the Air Canada Centre. Oh. Hey, ladies and gentlemen, you won't believe this. Everywhere I go, there's violence. <laughs> John Sandel, when an officer who takes pictures comes up, I walk in, he got so excited running up, he can't believe it, he tripped and cut himself. You, I mean, it's one of the yeah. deepest cuts I've ever seen. I'm, I'm not making fun of the blood was everywhere. John Sandel's been a good Thumbs guy. Thumbs up, John, yeah, yeah, and everybody over there. That was nice that you went and did that. So uh, your guy, James Reimer, you were in his corner from the get-go. Listen, let me tell you something. I know he was number three. I don't know who picks these stars. 42 shots. He kept them in there. This guy is the key. This guy is, as I'm not saying anything that nobody else realizes, but it, unbelievable that this guy would come up. You know, I have to say something. The only reason he's up here is because... The other injuries, or he'd have still been down there. And this is an awful thing to say, all right? Mm. I hate to say this, but it's too bad those injuries weren't a month earlier. I know that's a bad thing to say, but if those injuries had been a month earlier, he would have been up, they would have been in the playoffs. I thought uh, Dion Phaneuf, too, has really found his game. I think uh, he's been coming on. I think what happened with Dion when he first come here, he come in here with all the fanfare, he's going to change the, he's going to change the dressing room, he's going to, I think it was just too much. I think it's take the time that he's coming, he's finally coming into his own. He's not trying to do too much, as they say. He's looking good, looking good for the trade right now with him. But Reamer is a guy, I call him that, he's the doing best. And here he is with Elliot Friedman, Elliot. All right, thanks, Ron. Uh, Don is ripping the three-star selections because you were third and not first. But I remember a football coach winning a big game about 20 years ago and said, get out the wide-angle lens, boys. I'm getting ready to smile. And that's what you looked like at the end of the game tonight. Yeah, I was, I was excited. I mean, uh, felt like I wasn't getting the breaks the last couple of games. And, uh, and tonight, I mean, uh, you know, I think for the most part, I was getting the breaks. And, I mean, we deserved it as far as, as far as our effort as a team. I thought the boys played phenomenal again tonight. And, uh, you know, I was just glad to see them come back. And, uh, you know, I was just real proud of the way they worked. Well, you get your own breaks. And the big play you made was in the third period. And we're going to show you the video right here. It's Vanek and boys, the two quick saves you had to make back-to-back. Yeah, I mean, uh, Vanna came down, and uh, I know he's a shooter, and, and uh, I just tried to be big, and then uh, the rebound popped out, and I just tried to throw my leg out there, and, uh, you know, I got lucky, and so, uh, you know, I was just uh, lucky enough to make the save. James, just, I know players don't talk to goaltenders during the game, but after two periods, you guys are down one goal. You know if you don't win tonight in regulation, you're in big trouble. What's going on in that room? Uh, you know, we were just, uh, we were saying as a team, you know, we got to believe. We know we can do it. I mean, uh, you know, they had, uh, we had, I thought we had a, all right, second period, and, and and they were they came hard, and and uh, we knew we had to come out in third and, and work, and and we'd get our breaks, and uh, you know we were up in the room, guys were lively, and and they were excited, and so uh, we just we just came out, came out hard, and, and uh, we were lucky enough to get two goals. All right, last one for you. Well, last week we talked about the five hours with Andy Nowicki, but you know when you say you haven't been getting the breaks, is there anybody you talk to specifically after games like that, just to go over how you can get those breaks back? Um. Not in particular. I mean, uh, I talked to my wife a bit, you know. I, <laughs> she's a good sounding boy. She's a, she's a great woman. But, uh, you know, I mean, it's, uh, you know, I just, I go over the tape a little bit. Um, I talked to the goalie coach, Francois. You know, he, uh, he, he said I was playing well. You know, you're, you're technically there. You're, you're making the right plays. Just the puck wasn't hitting you. So uh, just keep, keep on keep on the path and, and uh, you know, things will turn around. And, you know, I was lucky enough to get a couple bounces and, and pucks hit me today. And so, uh, you know, it was just it was fun to get the win. All right. Congratulations, James. Thank you for your time. Yeah, thank you. Ron? You know, I was just saying. It would have been nice if, if they had to ask him why. <laughs> we, we know the story now. Well, do you know the story? Yeah, he grew up loving you. Cause oh, I see. I think, cause he's, I so think the way. It would have been nice, though, to ask them the question. The way we presented it last week is all they could yeah. get was you. So that's why. The folks, I, I tell you, Green Eye Monsters around here. Anyhow, Dwayne, I love Rollison. I said that. They're he's coming in Monday, yep. Yeah, and I'm going to tell you. I, said, I made a prediction when they made that trade. I said they put him in first spot. They will be in first spot. But another one I said, and I love to tell you because it gets the media mad. I said, Craig Anderson, when that trade was made before he came here, remember what I said? That's the trade of all trades, and they have something to look forward for next year. What a trade by Brian Murray on Craig Anderson. The uh, one just thing on Reimer here, the shot on Vanek, which you said they almost, I don't know if you thought they wasted one when they well, went so high. Vanek hold on, hold on, before you show it. All right, go ahead and show it. When you get wide like that, he, he, just, he just wires it. If he doesn't, if you go like this, 
I mean, this when you come out like that, folks, and you're a goaltender, it could be your life when he winds up like that. Could get you in the throat or something, but he come right out and cut it down. What's impressive is he made that great save that they showed in the pack, yep. uh, a low shot by Vanek, because normally a guy flinched right after getting one like that. The luckiest guys in the world to have him.